I saw this woman, you know, at the well, this story about a woman that was at the well, and I don't know, I kind of identified with her. I identified with her shame and her curiosity to why Jesus would want to talk to her or why Jesus would want to know her. You know, she had a past, she had a record, so why does Jesus want to know about her, you know? So I felt as though it was important also for me to put together a devotional so I can share more of my story and make this character real to someone else as she was real to me and make women all over understand that freedom begins in Christ. Freedom and purpose begins in him. It begins in that one encounter and it doesn't matter who you are, where you're from, where you're coming, where you, what you're doing, what you're about to do, what you're about to do and what you've just done, you know, that one encounter can change your life forever because it worked for me. This is not just something that has been pimped in the Bible. This is something that is real um, and it is just as real as it was 2000 years ago to here in 2014. <laughs> so, you know, this woman is me. I've placed part of me into this woman, but also I want to kind of expand and and bring to life the power of God's love, the power of this gospel that, you know, that saved me and that I believe in um, day by day. I wanted to show the power of faith because this encounter is all about faith. This journey has been about faith and it's not just one encounter that I had when I was feeling low. This is an encounter that I have every single day of my life in order for me to maintain you know, the freedom that I believe that Jesus has given me, you know? And that is one thing that I wanna give to another woman that may be the woman that I was six, seven years ago. And I feel like that's important. I wanna go beyond inspiring someone. I want to give someone a reason to live. So that's what I want, you know, every woman to experience, that love, that peace, that joy, and ultimately that freedom, you know, and that's what Living Waters is all about, freedom beginning in Christ. <laughs>